Hi, this is Mona McClellan, and you asked how to make your hair color last. And, you know, that's a great question. Everybody who colors their hair wants to know that they can make the vibrancy um, of the color and the shine last a long time. And, you know, I spent almost three decades in the hair industry. My specialty was uh, coloring hair. So here's what I can tell you about that topic. Well, first of all, you have to always have enough protein in your hair. And of course, you can get that from your diet. That's important that you have a good diet. But you can also buy a product called Red Can Cat um, Intensive Protein Reconstructor. I'm not selling that here. Um, that, that's why you still use on all of my clients. And it's a product that you use between, um, it's a treatment between your shampoo, rinse it out, and then put this on and leave it on for five minutes, rinse it out, and then do your conditioner. And you need to have you know, several treatments like this before you actually color your hair. Protein attracts color. So when you've got an abundance of protein in your hair, the color will stick better or stay in your hair better and longer. And then you have to make sure that what you're putting on your hair in between um, color services is protecting your hair. So you want to make sure you use a professional product that's for color treated hair, a good shampoo and a conditioner. Otherwise, if it's too harsh, it will just start to fade the color and pull that color out of your hair faster. Probably six to eight weeks um, is as long as, as it's going to last. And if you are using semi-permanent or permanent color, you are going to get a little bit of demarcation. What that means is this kind of thing. You can see on my hair. Now, um, I was born a redhead. This is about the color of my natural hair, but I help it out now. Put some highlights in. and um, and But this will come out, and I'll have to touch up my roots. Um, and then refresh my color. So what, I, what happens is the color goes on here, the, the root area, for about 20-25 minutes and then the rest of the color goes on the rest of the hair for another um, 15 minutes at the end to freshen up the color. But if you're not putting that protein in, over time your hair will just get um, drabber and have less bounce and less luster and less shine and you won't, you won't be getting the most, most out of your service. And we all know that if you color your hair, that um, that hair color a hair color is expensive. Even if you buy your own box, I don't know if it's ten or twenty dollars now, and a hair color service in a salon is very expensive. And so if you also, I was going to say, if you're going into a salon or even breathing in those fumes, you have to understand how toxic it is. Because um, you know, I retired because of chemical sensitivities from being in the salon. I had to learn how to serve in another way, and I turned to the internet. I found a group of friends, and what we're doing online is really fun, and we're doing really well with it. And I was going to say, it might be of interest to you because it'd be helpful for you if you're looking for more money so you can color your hair. Anyways, if you're curious at all as to what I'm doing, you can go to my website, heresanotherway.com, and I think the link is just below here. And if you, if you go there, you'll find a couple of things, exactly what we're doing and what it's all about, and some testimonials of some folks that we've helped. Now, I hope this has helped you. If nothing else, you got the information you're looking for about making color last. All the best.